guys, it's Lisa here. I'm back with a Dollar Tree haul. This one isn't very big um, compared to yesterday's, but um, there were a few things I didn't find at my closest Dollar Tree that I usually go to in Chicopee. Um, so I decided to go a little bit further away from home, which isn't very far, it's only 15, 20 minutes away. Um, and hopefully, you know, I was hoping to find a few things that I didn't find at um, my normal Dollar Tree. So I guess we'll start with stationary stuff. I found, wasn't looking for this, but of course I found it. Um, this really cute washi tape. It's just got colorful birds on it. And I thought that was pretty for my journal. And I picked up another set of the same stickers that I got yesterday. Um, I just, I was going through them and I liked them so much that I just decided to pick up another pack. Um, I especially like the, the inspirational sayings here. And then I just found out today that one of my friend's um, husbands, and I guess I could consider him my friend as well, um, had open heart surgery, like emergency open heart surgery, five weeks ago. I knew nothing about it. Um, we don't see each other very often. So I was surprised to hear about it, and um, I just picked up a card for him that looks like this. It says, as you recover, wishing you all the patience and strength you need, and hoping everything goes well for you. And I just thought I'd send that to him, you know, as a, hey, I'm thinking of you, and I hope you, you know, you get well soon. Um, I saw a picture of him recently, and he looks great. I'm, if I hadn't, if she hadn't posted that he had open heart surgery five weeks ago, I never would have known. So um, I'm glad he's okay and doing well. Um, so I just picked up that card to send to him. And next we'll go to HBA stuff. My significant other has been having a problem with his knees and I think it all stems from his feet because he's got bad feet, he's got neuropathy and he does, he's not able to walk flat on one of his feet. Um, so it puts everything off balance. And of course, if you would go to physical therapy like his podiatrist ordered him to, it might help him out. But I decided to pick up this pain relief balm uh, to see if it would help, you know, if you rubbed it on his knees, if it would help the, the ach achiness at all. Um, I don't know if it will, but I thought I'd give it a try for a buck. It's better than listening to him complain. <laughs> um, and I ran out of face, face wipes, makeup remover wipes. I don't know how, but I did. So I picked up these. Um, they're, if I could read them, it would be good. Global Beauty Care. It's collagen makeup cleansing wipes. You get 30, I think it's 30, yep, 30 in a pack. And I just thought I'd give these a try. Now decorations, or decor. I found a placemat. This is what actually what I went to Dollar Tree in West Springfield for, was to look for placemats. My Dollar Tree doesn't have any, at least not the fabric ones like this. Um, so I got two of these, and I'm not using them as placemats. Um, they're actually going to go up behind me when I decorate for fall, and I can do a video on that. And I'm just going to put them down nobody's really gonna see them this is in my bedroom nobody's really gonna see them but I will and I'll know that they're there so um, I wanted to pick up those they had several styles and this was the one that I liked the best that I thought was you know the most favorable for my decor um, and I been on the search for these not very hard but I've been on the search for them these um, they're really called but these balls of, of twigs sticks whatever they are <laughs> these decor balls um, I've been looking for these for you know like spring when I change out the fall decor um, to put them in a vase as a filler or something else I don't know but I wanted to get some of these so I got the medium color the dark color in the big size and the medium and the light medium and dark in the small size. So you get four in the large and six in the small. And another Halloween thing that I'm, it, it is 
staying in the plastic bag. I will pick it up and show you, but um, <laughs> it's got to stay in the bag because it's like really insane as far as the fall off for the glitter. But I haven't seen anyone haul this and I haven't seen it in any of my Dollar Trees. I think it's adorable. And it's got a little switch on the bottom to turn it on and off. But I just think it's so cute. They had it in black as well. Um, but I just, I liked the orange. Um, but it's got to get sprayed because the fallout is like absolutely ridiculous. I'll show you the bag. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. But it, it's, it's crazy. I don't even want to touch it because I'm going to get glitter everywhere. Oh yeah, it's already on my clothes. Um, and last but not least, I picked up some Christmas garland. It's got little stars on it. It's silver. It's very small. I really don't want to take it out of here until Christmas time. But it's fairly thin. But I only have a tabletop tree that's about three feet tall, maybe, if that. Um, yeah, I guess it's about three feet, maybe two feet. And I've been using regular size garland, which I guess is fine. But I thought this might be cute on it. You know, it's a smaller tree, so the smaller garland might look nice. So I picked this up. And, oh, I lied. That's not the last thing. The last thing is carpet cleaner. Um, I don't know how well this is going to work. Ew, and it feels like it's wet. Um, but it's spot and stain remover. And all you do is spray it, you know, and kind of rub it and, and pat it to um, get the stain out. My cat caught a mouse the other day. Yeah, I'm putting that on the floor because it is wet, or at least it feels wet to me. My cat caught a mouse the other day, a little baby mouse. And I don't know if it was sometime in the night after I went to bed before my significant other got home from whatever he was doing, um, but my significant other stepped on it, um, and I assume it was either dead or very incapacitated. So he stepped on it, not seeing it because it was dark in the house. Um, and then he walked upstairs on the beige, very, very light beige carpet on the stairs. And we have blood marks going up the stairs. Like every second or third step, there's a, a spot of blood. Um, so I'm gonna try and remove it with that. I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but keep my fingers crossed because I really want the blood out of the carpet. Um, but anyway, that's it for my haul. Like I said, it wasn't very big, especially compared to last, um, yesterday's. But, um, I just, I had a few things I had to pick up and I figured I'd share with you guys in case you were looking for any of them. And I just, I love this pumpkin. I just think it's so adorable. And like I said, they have it in black. So I know a lot of you are doing the, um, you know, the darker, the black or the, and the white for the, uh, farmhouse decor. So they are coming out, hopefully in your stores. And enjoy the rest of your weekend. It's already Sunday, one more day off, and then back to the grind on Tuesday. But um, enjoy the rest of your weekend, enjoy your friends and family, and be safe, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching, bye-bye.